Hello YouTube and welcome back to the channel. In this video I'm going to show you how to fit a decal to your rear window of your bus or in fact anywhere that you want to put it. Now there's a lot of groups out there on Facebook uh, and Instagram and sometimes it can be a little bit daunting I suppose trying to pick one to join and I guess there's no harm being part of all of them really. Um, but when RG and Michael got in touch over Facebook because um, they'd seen my van I'd in a few of my videos, um, I was more than happy to join the group. So I've got me one of these. Let's get fitting. First thing I'm going to do is work out where I'm going to put it. Um, now I've seen a couple of vans with it down there, on there. I didn't think about putting it up in the corner and having it dubs, outlaws, established. But I think it's gonna go for a traditional bang in the middle. First thing I'm gonna do with this one is detach the established in 2018 off the bottom uh, with my trusty pinky cutting scissors. Um, it's gonna make it a little bit easier to to fit it. So let's just remove this bit quick for you. Another tool you might need is one of these. Um, this is like a vinyl spreader, presser, putter on her. Obviously you've got to put it on but this helps you smooth it out. Now you can use a credit card and things like that but the edge itself is a little bit hard whereas this one, I'll bring it in, it's got a little like fabric edge to it. These are quite handy. They're only about a quid, flea bait, handy as. So before you attach anything on here, or anything on your van, anywhere you're going to put it, side, front, bottom, roof, whatever, just make sure it's clean first. Um, you don't want no like dirt and grime and stuff underneath the stickers because they won't, well, they will stick, um, but you, you have lots of lumps and bumps and stuff in your stickers and you won't like that. Right, so I cut mine in half, so I'm going to start with the established part. Now before you do it, obviously get it on a hard surface and just smooth it out. Um, when you come to remove the clear film at the top, what you're looking for is the letters and everything to come with it. So if you've smoothed it out first, it's going to be easier to take it apart. So let's get that done. And let's stick her on. Okay, so we want this right in the centre. Go right there. Smoothing out tool. You want to just make sure each letter, number, shape, whatever you're putting on is nice and smoothed out before you remove the clear cover, which is just a transparent carrier basically for a sticker. So we're just going to pop this off. Because I've got a fabric one of these, I can now just go ahead over the letters and just making sure that there's no air bubbles left in some of the letters. Happy days. Part one. Part two and three to come. What I've done on this side is cut this part in half. I've gone straight through the U. Um, I'm going to line up the bottom of the U with the edge of the window. And that should look pretty sick. Alright, let's remove the carrier. So it's the clear part. Alright, let's line it up how we want it. Start with my U. Just in there. You first. Working backwards. Oh. Dead. I don't need to keep spelling it out to you, do I? Right, 
Nope. All right. Again with the smoothing tool. Let's make sure you're smoothing it out. Try and get rid of some of those bubbles if there is any bubbles. Can have a closer look in the mo when we peel it off. That's cool, right on the edge. Then remove the outer film. Nice, D looks good. You've got a tiny little bubble in. If you do get some bubbles, you can kind of work them out to the edge. And they just come out. B's good. That's good. Oh, it's good. And the, yeah. it's alright. Right, let's move on to the rest. So again, this time, working with the U, I'm going to start on this side. Oh, really? Just going to tack that round a bit. Cool with that. Getting the U in a nice spot. So you know it's nice and straight. Decent. Right. Then work along each letter individually, making sure, if you can, to work out some of these air bubbles along the way. So if you found this helpful, you know, comment below. I don't mind comments, comments are nice. Subscribe to the channel. The channel's nearly a thousand by the way. So if you want to win um, this. So you get yourself a hat, T-Dubs jumper, and a couple of T-Dubs stickers. All you have to do is comment I am 1000 when the channel hits a thousand subscribers. Happy days. Right, let's peel this off. And then check for bubbles. Those are okay. Well, the S is all right. W is good, A is good, L is good, T is spot on, and the U is peachy. Right, let's take you back here and have a look. Decent. Nice quick short vid. Thanks for watching guys. If you haven't subscribed to the channel then please hit the subscribe button. Smash the thumbs up button if you like it and comment below. Also, if you haven't already done, hit the bell icon and get notifications of when my next videos are out. This is Tom, this is T-Dubs, and this, if I take you in a bit closer, is the Dub Outlaw sticker. See ya.